Hello everyone, I'm the Modern Sea Witch and I received my box from the Witch's Box today for May 2022 and let's check into this and see what uh, they sent us. And let me just say before I start, I'm not affiliated with the Witch's Box. Um, I paid for the subscription and this box retails for $75 US including shipping. Okay, let's see what they have inside for us. And I just want to say a quick thank you to my daughter. Uh, she gifted me this beautiful athame. Okay, let's get this open. Now I have no idea what this month's theme is. Okay, they always do a nice job packaging this, plus it be. Then let's get this out of the way. Okay. All right, so it looks like for May, they've curated a fierce protection box. This will be interesting to work with. Again, I love these paper clips. They're very unique. Refer back to the sheet. Uh, in just a minute, make sure I have everything that they should have included. And our personal oracle card, so a tarot card. All right, La Pepesa. Hmm. So, I'm going to guess this is the Empress. We shall see. I will have to translate this one later. We have the Fierce Protection Salt Bowl spell. That'll be interesting to work with. We've got a Grimoire page uh, for your Book of Shadows uh, about Rose, another one about Lavender, and another one about Cedar. So the three very common uh, herbs that I work with See what we have down in here. So, okay. okay, so we have a nice pouch of lavender. A nice pouch of rose petals, so more to add to our apothecary cabinets. Trying to make sure I'm not missing anything down in here. I have been known to miss things down in this packaging. I know they want to keep things safe. However, it does make it a little difficult to make sure you have everything and not make a mess doing so. Oh, I like that uh, washi tape that they used. Okay, so looks like we have some thorns. So maybe some rose stems. This one. It's definitely not the same as the other two. So I'm not sure what plant that might be from, but protection uh, spells. Thorns come to mind, so that will be a part of that, I'm sure. And we have a vial, it looks like rose petals in there, but it could be hibiscus. Let me give it a sniff and see. I want to say that's dried rose. 
It's not all a scent, but I do see some thorns in there as well, so I'm definitely led uh, to believe that that is Rose. And we have a candle. This one has a little bit of gold at the bottom. Looks like it's been brushed on. More washi tape. That's an interesting pine cone. Looks sort of like a rose. Very nice with the scent there. Set that to the side. We have a rose in here trying to determine if that is silk or if that is real it definitely feels like it could be real but the stem doesn't lead me to that i'll have to check it out on the packaging on the little sheet Gonna do one more pass through the box here. I'm gonna set this aside and check that sheet. Okay, so we have our candle and our apothecary bags of lavender and rose petals. Okay, so this is a vial of rose thorns, although more rose petals than thorn. There's one thorn. And then there is a bundle of dried rose stems with thorns. Yes. Um, like I said, this one just might be a different variety uh, of rose plant since the thorns are different and the, and the stem itself, you can tell, is completely different. We have... Okay, this, so this is called a a cedar rose so like I said it definitely was um, a, a cone from an evergreen um, but it, it comes from the cedar plant or the cedar tree so this is a preserved rose interesting I don't know how they preserved it like I said it did feel like a real rose I wonder how long that would last if I weren't to actually work with that. Set you over here. Bring all this down here and frame. And of course we have our Oracle card. We have the spell. And let me hold that there so you can get a better look at that if you want to pause. Again, the three pages for your Book of Shadows. On those different ingredients. Again, this is the Witch's Box for May 2022. It retails for $75 US, uh, including shipping. I'd have to say they've given us a spell to work with, so that'll be... Um, nice uh, to go ahead and do another protection spell so definitely check out their boxes if you have any interest now that you've seen this one and if you have any questions about the boxes please feel free to comment below let me know if there's anything you'd like to see in the future thanks for joining me i hope you have a great day be sure to follow along on my blog at modernseawitch.com and on Instagram at Modern Sea Witch. You never know what I'll be doing next. Have a great day.